Hey, Phil Mutri here and welcome to today's video. I want to go over something that happened in my life that basically made a change in my life and I want to further extend that and expand it to how we how I've gone through job the job the job and then all of a sudden became an online entrepreneur. So, I'm 43 right now and back in my early 20s, I was given this as a gift. And this is a guitar. And this guitar is a Fender Stratocaster. And it's a it's a David Gilmore edition. And this was the first guitar that I learned to play as an electric six string. And back then I had a I had a cheap Fender amplifier and, and that's what I played. I, I enjoyed playing it and, and I learned how to play this guitar. Since then, um, I kind of graduated myself, and as you go, as even in business and things that you enjoy, you graduate to different levels. And in this case, um, going from this David Gilmore edition uh, Fender Strat, I went to I went to this, and this is what I have now. This is a Gibson Les Paul. Standard uh, studio edition, very beautiful guitar. This thing really rocks out. And as you can see behind me, and you'll see this in, in a lot of my videos, actually pretty much all of them, is I have a, I have a Marshall half stack behind me uh, with a 1959 hardwired head. And I tell you, going along with a Gibson Les Paul uh, premium guitar, that thing really rocks out. So. I want to go a step further with playing guitar. I first started out playing a six string electric guitar and I have an acoustic too. Um, but one, there was this one time in my, probably my mid twenties where I was invited out to, to go to a, go to a recording studio and not really to go in there to record or anything like that. But what we, what we did is we all met and we were going to play just just jam out. We're going to have a jam session together. And we went through the jam session. Um, we went to the jam session. And basically what happened is the bass guitar player didn't show up. So we were short a bass guitar player. And I had never, ever played a bass guitar in my life. And I said, pick me. I'll try it. So what I did is I ended up picking up a bass guitar. It was a Fender, it was a Fender jazz guitar, and it didn't have active pickups. It was just a standard, standard bass guitar that they had in the recording studio. But when I picked up that guitar and I took and I hit the E string, which is the which is the bottom end string, after hooking it into an amplifier, and just the vibration of just hitting that string, it was almost like it was almost like love, uh, instant love. Um, now, I, I had played the six-string electric guitar, but I don't know if you've ever done anything in life to where, you, where you've tried something new, and right at that instant, immediate point when you've tried it, you loved what you did, and you continued doing it. So I want to show you something else here. And what I'm going to show you is a result of what happened that day. This is a Gibson Les Paul Special Edition bass guitar. Ever since I picked up that bass guitar in that recording studio in my mid-20s, I loved it so much that I play the bass guitar more than I play the six-string electric guitar. Downstairs in my basement, I have a full stack of two YM410s from Yorkville which basically means that in each cabinet there's four 10-inch subwoofers. And what I use for an amplifier head is a, is a YM800 watt amplifier by Yorkville. Uh, just to give you an idea of what, that would, what I'd be able to use that for is I could go into, into, a, into a big, big auditorium and be able to use that system. It's a very, very good system. And... We used, to, we used to practice downstairs in the basement of a friend's house years ago, 
And that's where we first started our first started our first band. We had our first band there. And it, the gentleman's wife, the gentleman's name was Todd. He was the one that had the house. And, and his, his girlfriend, not wife, but his girlfriend at the time, um, she would always get she would always get mad because that bass guitar would would shake the whole house. And she had she had like things on the wall. It would it would vibrate things. It would vibrate things off the wall and put them on the floor. But uh, I tell you, I really, really, really enjoy playing the bass. And to expand the story a little more, this guitar, this guitar, it it made a dream for me come true. And one of the dreams that I always had was. I always wanted to, I loved music so much and I loved concerts so much, but I wanted, one of my dreams was to get up on a stage in front of people and play along with a band. And I have success, successfully been able to do that. I've been on many stages back back years ago and you know, I miss it, I miss it a lot. I, I, I play this thing by myself, I wish there was a uh, a, a drum player along with a, a six-string electric guitar player and be able to play play along with a band again. Um, but but I, a dream came true with this guitar. I got up on a stage many times and played in front of crowds of people, and, and I enjoyed it very much. Now, mind you, it was good old classic rock and roll, which is amazing to me. I love all kinds of music, but it was it was good old classic rock and roll good old hard stuff. And I now I'm going to expand it even more into, into online business. Um, years ago, I worked, every, I worked every two weeks to get a paycheck from somebody who was making a lot more money than what I was. And you know what? I was starving, starving going paycheck to paycheck to paycheck. Every time you get a paycheck, everybody had a handout to take your money, the bill collectors, the loan collectors, you name it. They were out there to grab your money. And you know what? I never, ever got ahead. And finally, I went into, I went into my, last, my, last, my last paying job that I, that I went to um, was actually, I'm sweating here. Yeah, gosh, I'm sweating here. It's hot today. It's a beautiful day outside, and it's hot in the house. Um, I just turned the air conditioning on, but uh, the central air, but I tell you, it is so hot. But anyways, um, getting back to that, I, I went to I went into work early one morning to the last job I ever went to to get a paycheck. You know what? I nobody has job security. When people say that there's job security, I want you to think twice about that because my paycheck got cut off for good. I went into work early one morning and there was a sign on the door and it said, basically said, "Sorry about your luck." We're closed for good. Find another job. How devastating that is when you have a. At the time, I had a, I had a mortgage payment to pay, I had bills to pay, and I had a I had a wife to provide for at the time as well, and it's it was devastating. But the nice thing about it was, is it gave me the opportunity to start my own business, and I started my own business in my my mid, probably around 26, 27 years of age, I started my own business. And what I was, was I was on a, I was an on-road administrator for, for corporation computers. And eventually what happened is we had a recession hit and my phone stopped ringing and I wasn't getting any work. And that scared me again. And you know what? That was only that was only about eight years ago, uh, eight, eight to nine years ago in there. And I still had savings and I went through my savings, but I couldn't find any work. But what I refused to do is I refused, I totally refused to go and work for somebody else that I had to call a boss and to, in order to get a paycheck every two weeks. I, I refused to do it. I would not do it because there's no job security. And I just, I couldn't put myself to, to, making, to making, say, $12 or $13 an hour. Well, that boss was bringing in $180 to $200 an hour or more for the work that I was actually doing for them. 
And what happened was, is an opportunity came, came out for me. And that was an opportunity to be an online entrepreneur. And I started that. And it was just like picking up this bass guitar and hitting that string for the first time and falling instantly in love with it. Because what happened to me when I started that online business, and I wish I had started that when I was around 26, 27, back when they had just internet DOS base, um, you know, I, I would have been successful a long, long time ago. Internet marketing is, and uh, in, in an online business is something that I loved from day one. I do it day in and day out with passion, just like I play this bass guitar. And it's when, it, when you pick up something and you do something that you 150% love and you do it day in and day out, you don't get tired. You don't get tired doing it and you love doing it. It's made a difference in my life. And I've gone ahead and I've made differences in other people's lives. Now, I'm not saying that everybody that I've contacted or been in contact with online business has been happy. You can never make everyone happy. But for those that you can make happy and you do make happy, you make a difference in their lives as well as you make a difference in your own. So the moral of the story today is it can be anything in life. Look at me. I had a, a Fender Stratocaster guitar that I loved playing when I got it for a gift. But when I picked up this bass guitar and I hit this one string right here, and fell in love with it from day one and decided to go this route where this made a dream come true. It made a dream for me to come true, made a dream come true for me by getting me up on stages in front of people playing and making people happy out in a crowd, making people happy and enjoying the music that was coming from this, as well as a drum player and a guitar player and, and a singer. And I, I sang too. It was great. And then taking an online business and loving that too and making a difference in people's lives and making people all around the world international happy. What I'm saying is you can do this too. You can start an online business and make a lot of people happy. I would rather see you be successful with something that you put your heart and soul into and be happy doing it with passion and making a difference in your life and making a difference in other people's lives rather than having no job security and waking up every day going to a nine to five job, waiting for that check to come in every two weeks only to give it out for everybody who has their hand out for it. You can start an online business today and I would like and love to show you how you can do this and how you can become successful at doing it. Below you're going to see a link that will lead back to one of my sites where you can get daily information on how you too can be successful online. If there is not a link, there will be an area where you can enter in a name and email address or just an email address where you can supply that information and I will help you daily with online marketing strategies, tips, and success strategies that can make you successful starting today, tomorrow, forever, and a day. Thank you so much for watching this video. I know I've gone through, a, I've gone through quite a novel here, but I enjoyed doing this video today, and I hope it brought, brought great value to your life today. I look forward to seeing your success online, and if I can help you do that today, tomorrow, forever, and a day, I commit to doing so with passion and love. Thank you so much. We'll talk soon.